Callum Davison is just about to take a penalty here, Ray. It's up again, Paddy Kenny in the goal. He runs up to take the goal. Left body hand scores into the back of the net. It's a brilliant penalty from Davison. Crucial goal for Preston. Preston 1, Sheffield United 0. Thanks, Natalie. wins to stay in the championship and Nigel has to wheel and deal to bring players in in January. Well it's one of the biggest championship games of the season. Forest fate will be decided in games like this. This is a game that Knotts can't afford to lose, and these guys want to have nerves to steal today. Here's Ref. Hi, Nigel. Happy New Year to you. Good luck today. Well, when he walked through the door a year ago last January, Derby were at a real low. How's Nigel done in his first year? Well, we think he's done great, we're, and we're very lucky to have him. He's drastically reduced the wage bill on the debt, hasn't he? Well, we, we've worked very hard to get the squad size down to a side that's competing for position. Well, there are many more famous football managers than the one we've got in the tactics truck today. Hello. Back in my time, I stand old now, but in my time, black and white boots, that was it. Well, when I knew I was coming to see you today, I got this out of the attic. It's my old um, soccer tactics book from when I was a kid. Are you a big tactician? Players nowadays just play football. They don't understand football. In the first half, even though you won 5-1, it seemed strange to say defensively you didn't play so well. We are not well organised. He taught him all he knows, I guess. <laughs> I didn't. I would break my neck if I tried to do that. Well, I first met Alan Birchnell ten years ago here at the training ground and what struck me straight away was his love of life and Leicester City. Here we go, look at that. He's still got it, Bert. <laughs> Come on, pick out all your future signings for me now. <laughs> Well, this book's not thick enough, Natalie. Well, do you have a good relationship with the chairman and the board here? I have a great respect for his setup of his club and how it works. That's entirely up to the owner of the club. Eight managers were sacked in just ten days. So what or who's to blame for such a sudden spate of sacking? <laughs> Goal at Deepdale, Natalie Jackson is following uh, the Preston Sheffield United game in the Championship. Yes, 2-0 here now, Ray. Neil Meller just got his Preston second. He danced past two defenders and hit a lovely right-footed shot. It flew in past Paddy Kenny. Just before that, Sheffield United were really starting to assert themselves in the game. Stephen Quinn had a goal disallowed. It was offside. Billy Sharp had a penalty appeal waved away. But it's Preston who were 2-0 up and it's hard to think that they were bottom in January after this display at the moment. Preston North End 2, Sheffield United 0.